Howdy y'all, Bourbon Cowboy here. It's Happy Father's Day. We got the Bourbon Cat and we got the Bourbon Cowboy. And so you may be asking yourself, what does dad want for Father's Day? I got you covered. He wants some whiskey, of course. And he wants a, a nicely made old fashioned. So it's the classic American cocktail. Dad loves an old fashioned. You gotta know how to make one. So Urban Cowboy is here to help you out. When I use my old fashioned, make my old fashioned, I like to use a rye. You can use a, a bourbon. If I use a bourbon, I use a high rye bourbon. Uh, but today I'm just gonna go with a rye. And I also like to go with something a little bit higher on the alcohol content because this drink really is all about the whiskey. Okay, so today I'm going with Sagamore Rye. Now this bottle is special uh, because when South Jersey Bourbon Drinkers sponsored a trip down there uh, to the Sagamore Farm and the Sagamore Distillery, Bourbon Cowboy was there and, and the Whiskey Wednesday crew and we actually tasted and selected this barrel. Our bus driver that day was Mr. William. So we named the bottle Mr. William, the Magic Sagamore Rye Bus. Okay, so that's this bottle here. Comes in at 110 proof. So it really makes a nice strong drink, age six years. Okay, so that's the whiskey we're using for this. Again, you can use a bourbon, but it should be a high rye if you're gonna use a, a bourbon. What else are we gonna need for the old fashioned? Well. Uh, we got our orange bitters. Uh, we're gonna use an orange peel, cherry, and the highlight is, this is brown sugar simple syrup. Now, uh, my friend Mark McLaughlin over at Old Line Distillery put me onto this. So normally you make a simple syrup, equal parts sugar, water, cook it up. This is the same concept. You're just using equal parts brown sugar and water, cooking it up, and you get this nice, sweet, dark uh, product as a result. Okay, and this we're gonna have a little bit of ice. So let's get started on our um, old fashioned. Okay, so you ready, Bourbon Cat? He's a little distracted today. Uh, okay, so first thing we're gonna do. And we're gonna grab, we're gonna grab a cherry, and we're gonna drop that in to our glass, and we're gonna get a little orange peel. Here, we're just gonna cut a little peel off of that orange, and we got the cherry, and we're just gonna, uh, we're just gonna muddle these together. And all we're doing here is we're just trying to get the flavors. To jump out on this orange peel and this cherry and so just mash them up pretty good and if you uh you know, give it a little nose you can really uh really say that, that that comes out now some people will use a sugar cube in there too but if you're using a simple syrup no sugar cube necessary okay so uh, from there we're gonna We'll go with the bitters next. Uh, four or five dashes of that. And now it's time for our simple syrup. Now I'm gonna use uh, one ounce of the, again, this is brown sugar simple syrup. You certainly couldn't use regular old simple syrup. Either way, I just thought this would be a little something special uh, for this Father's Day cocktail is the brown sugar and um all right from so from there we're gonna put some ice in our glass okay and <laughs> we're not gonna forget the whiskey though don't worry whiskey's coming next all right so we're going three big ounces on this now And again, that is the highlight of the drink. Okay. Now, I like to shake my cocktails, but for this particular one, 
we're gonna use a bar spoon and we're just gonna we're gonna stir. Okay. The key here, you don't wanna under stir. We're looking for about 50 rotations uh, to get all those oils, get everything all married together and happy. And you don't you don't wanna under stir. Good old fashioned. Okay. Now, again, opinions vary. I like to add just a touch of club soda to my drink. You don't have to. It's all up to you. I like it. It takes a little bit of the sweet out and gives me that little bit of fizz. Bourbon Cat, he likes it too. Well, he's getting out of here. All right. So, and hang around for the best part now. All right, so again, if you're wondering what dad wants for Father's Day, grab him a bottle of whiskey, Sagamore spirit is just fine, and make him an old fashioned just like this, and he'll be a happy man. Hmm. Boy, that brown sugar really makes a difference. This packs a little bit of a punch, three ounces, 110 proof. We got the cherries in there. We got the orange peel in there. It's a flavor explosion. And it is really delicious. And um, again, happy Father's Day to all the dads. We'll see you next time on Bourbon Cowboy.